Hello folks, and this is Kiki. Uh doing Let's Play, Iron Man, World of War, Team Assault. Uh this is revisiting the uh level that we've done before, Aerial Defense Force. Uh I've already done this level in a previous uh thing, um of my B seventeen Mauver Moment comparisons. And uh, basically, we'll just go ahead and revisit it since we went through all the other uh, World at Wars. And thank goodness this is the last time we have to do this. So, oh yeah, and I gotta remember, uh, Bazooka down below. Luckily, they would give you like a couple minutes of forgiveness, but that that Bazooka man can kill you sometimes if you're not careful. But anyway, let's go ahead and revisit it and see uh, if my first observations are a little bit different. Right now, uh, I believe I said that uh, this one doesn't give directions and it's a little bit hard to tell. And uh, after playing uh, Final Front, uh, there I've noticed that it they do sort of tell you where they are with the red dots on the uh, radar and they do give you enough time to respond uh compared to it uh land sea and air has to be by far the hardest of the uh b17 bomber moments of the series And uh, this one's the only one that includes uh, ground uh, objects, like I said, the bazooka men, uh, the field artillery, uh, etc., and so forth. But actually, doing this the uh, second time around after playing uh, Lancey and Air and playing Final Front, it is a little bit easier, but it still can pwn me a little bit, but at least I know what to look for now. Uh, but since I've already beat this once, I'm going to go ahead and save state through this uh, periodically. Just like I said, I've already done this before and I, have, I see no reason to do this again with been more than one video. As you can see, uh, uh, it pretty much wasn't very long anyway, so I figured I would save you guys some time on that. But anyway, like I said, uh, last video, if uh, anybody has any LP requests uh, for turn-based strategy games or uh, just any games in general that's not too advanced, uh, I can go ahead and give it a try. And here we go with the uh, ground section here, as you can see. But like I said, it, it, this is rather short mission. But then go ahead and submit your requests, and I'll go ahead and try my best on them. Uh, I still have my two LPs I need to do, but other than that, uh, I'm kind of free on these, and uh, it looks like I got shot by the field cannon. So we'll go ahead and resume that part section again. Like I said, rather than waste your time, I'll we'll just rewind back to this section. But anyway, I'll go ahead and let you just enjoy me shooting ground objects. Uh, surprisingly, uh, this is the only game that really incorporates the field artillery. There's one version of those in the uh, land, sea, and air, but, but that's it. And I don't know why they didn't use those more often. But uh looks like we're at the end of the level here. So we'll go ahead and become a graham cracker again uh, for not very long, and we'll parachute. There we go. And this time, it actually details the parachute, and we'll meet it with our buddies. And they're very disproportionate. Some are bigger, some are smaller, as you can see there. 
But anyway, this is Kenny signing out. Later.